It's time to vote for your December Ride of the Month. Vote A for Archie Bellamy's gritty ride on Here Comes the Dream at Toaster. Prominent for the entire race, the 12-year-old chased the leader and headed him with three left to jump and extended his lead as the race continued. He was briefly challenged but stretched clear of his rivals, jumping the last well to record his third victory at the track and his second on the Bellamy. Balak Marl is trying now to come with a run in second place, reducing the cap to about three lengths, but here comes the dream, is not stopping. Fabulous win for the veteran, here comes the dream. Vote B for Nina Carberry's effort on Comera Tricks at Fairy House. Held in a nice position just off the front pair by Carberry, the filly maintained that position until the pair made headway with two furlongs remaining. With a furlong left to run, Carberry asked the question of her mount and she duly responded with a battling display to take the honours by just under a length. And it is still Peace and Milan. Comra Trick, one last gasp effort on the outside and is closing as they go to the line. She's got to get up on the near side. Vote C for Richie McLernan's resolute ride on Very Live at Lingfield. In extremely testing conditions, McLernan and Very Live were handy on the outside for much of the race, taking over four out, but soon challenged for the lead and overtaken by Bold Bachelor. A mistake by Bold Bachelor, two out, handed the initiative back to Very Live, but he was again headed on the run-in before battling back to win by the tightest of margins. Very Live fighting all the way to the line here. Bold Bachelor in front from Very Live, who's coming again. Another great finish here. Oh! Very Live, did he get back up? Vote D for Johnny Burke's gutsy ride on Apple's Jade. Leopardstown. Taking a keen hold, Burke and his mount chased leader Jer's girl and was pushed along two out and began to close in on the long-time leader as they approached the final flight. Drawing level with the leader a hundred yards from the line, the filly battled gamely to win by a head under a determined Burke. Inside the last hundred yards, Jer's girl is all out looking for the line. Apples Jade is rallying on the inside. Apples Jade and Jonathan Burke on the inside. Vote E for Cathy Gannon's from the front ride on Captain Kendall at Lingfield. Jumping well from the stalls, Gannon manoeuvred her mount to the rail. Turning for home, the pair were put under pressure by rivals Perford Green and Beggar's Luck, with all three in a line with half a furlong to go. Captain Kendall kept finding to land a thriller under Gannon. Clement finishing well, Celtic Ava down the outside as well, stamp of approvals well beaten, what a finish up front here, Captain Kendall seeing it out, Captain Kendall for Cathy Gannon makes all. Don't delay, vote today. Go to attheraces.com forward slash ride.